A laryngeal cleft is a connection between the posterior or back part of the airway and the esophagus. Less severe clefts involve the larynx, while more severe clefts extend into the trachea. Open repair is frequently used for severe clefts. A horizontal incision is made in the skin. The strap muscles are identified and divided in the midline and retracted. The larynx and the trachea is then divided in the midline. Care is taken to divide the larynx so that the vocal cords are not injured. The cleft is visualized in its entirety. Mucosal flaps are elevated along the length of the cleft to separate the esophagus from the trachea and the larynx. The esophageal side is closed first, starting from the bottom of the cleft with interrupted sutures. The knots are left in the esophageal lumen. An interposition graft of the periosteum from the sternum, clavicle, or the tibia is placed between the two layers. The tracheal mucosa is then closed with the knots and the airway lumen. The airway is then closed beginning with the larynx to ensure that the vocal cords are approximated at the same level. The wound is then closed, leaving the Penrose drain on top of the strap muscles. <laughs>